Evan Hansen's been in my life for about six years. I've learned to slam on the brake before I even turn the key. I don't think anyone could anticipate that something would be a cultural phenomenon or would permeate things other than just the theater community and would ultimately become a major motion picture. Step out, step out of the sun because you've learned, because you've learned. When you're falling in a forest and there's nobody around. Evan struggles with anxiety and a bit of depression. He is very lost and has a lot of difficulty connecting. Um, no one signed your cast. Now we can both pretend we are friends. I remember when I first saw Dear Evan Hansen, how surprised I was, how emotional it is. I got an email from your school about that boy, Connor Murphy. Connor took his own life. He what? We didn't think Connor had any friends. And then we see this. It seems to suggest that you were his best friend. Being a part of this has meant so much to me. I was initially so moved when I saw it on stage. There's so many people who need to see Evan's story. So, you and Connor, tell us something. Um. Were you ever actually friends with him? Maybe you should tell him the truth. I tried, but once I started, I just couldn't stop. Connor showed me that, that I wasn't alone. Nobody is. So, let that lonely feeling wash away. Maybe there's a reason to believe you'll be okay. One of the more beautiful things about the whole Evan Hansen experience at large has been watching fans giving it a life of its own. Tattoos even of lyrics and open letters about how it's affected their family relationships and their love of themselves. I think it struck a nerve because it's true to our lives. It's real, it's authentic. And it allows us to feel less alone. You will be found. With the film, people will continue to latch on to parts and characters and songs and incorporate it in their lives and make it their own. It's so clearly going to live on, whether it's girls who connect to Zoe or parents who feel seen by the Murphys or single mothers who feel seen by Heidi. Oftentimes, the moment that we're in feels like the only moment that will ever exist. But that's not the case. You